in Azle, Texas. He's got Marlowe in the backfield. Here is Jamie on Marlowe. And he's got a huge run on first down. And Marlowe gashes LSU. Marlowe again. Doubts one of whom never showed up on campus was a grad transfer from Michigan. Marlowe trying to stretch. He'll be met at the edge. Play action. Seals on the run. A little wobbler, but it's complete. A Vanderbilt first down. One vault. Yeah, they only returned 673 receiving yards from last year after missing Kalija Lipscomb. Here's Marlowe again. You think he'd be Brave busy? Guy, an Atlanta guy. I've got a Dansby drop in for you later. Seals lets it go. And that's caught just shy of midfield. Just keep it simple, but he lulls you. Leach will lull you into a sense that he's simple too, and that you can get. Ed Ogeron and Bo Pelini said that when we talked to him this week about, boy, if we had film. Used in there. I think there was a little unknown of would it be all Mike Leach's air raid? Would it be a little bit of what they did last year sprinkled with air raid? Ben Bresnahan up the sideline. Seals steps forward, drops back, and he'll dump it out of the backfield. And they're going to continue to get better week to week. Seals. Trying to escape that push. And he lowers his shoulder and took a hit at the line of scrimmage. This offensive line thing. <laughs> I used to do that to guys on D-line. <laughs> Vandy just one of five on third down. College station against AM. Seals over the middle. Incomplete. Here's Jamie Amarlo. With him at the quarterback position, but hey, <laughs> I was way wrong, obviously. Yeah. Here's Marlowe. Don't pull up my picks either for Nation this morning. First half. Second and four now for Vandy. Seals on the rollout. Slides into second with a pickup of two. He said, well, if all's even, I'm going to go in the other direction. But then he kind of had a little bit of a smile and said, but man, I think we could win tight football games, and we didn't. Because of that, and I think that's what Ken Seals is referencing. They were in a tight game at Texas A&M, and they believed. Five days after getting back in June, and there was some apprehension amongst the players. They wanted to get their test back before they returned to the field. On third and six, got Stevens caught up on a blitz, and it's off the hands of Marlowe as the descendant of a war chief. Fantastic article in the Baton Rouge Advocate that recognized he was the only surviving child of his parents. Seven sets of twins. Five now for Ken Seals in Vanderbilt. Seals pressured. They got three sacks tonight. He gets rid of this one and pulls the only one of us has got a recent headshot. Here's Seals to throw. Pressured again. Gets touched from behind and dragged down, and lucky it wasn't picked up. I want you to take us inside Ken Seal's head here. Starting against LSU, he's got one game under his belt as a college quarterback. You came in to Vanderbilt as a junior college transfer. Well, How many extra rides on your short. Peloton bike are you adding each week because of this increase in it's bacon? primal, primal diet. We're going, uh, we're going paleo. How much does a plate of millionaire's bacon cost? Uh... I think it was like 475. Something. They called it. You got a degree for keyboarding and organic chemistry. And I mean, actually, sorry, communication was the degree, Jordan. We didn't have a uh, <laughs> keyboarding. Was not a. He's got a lot of work tonight, guys. Junior from Winter Haven, Florida. He was a three-star recruit. Only eight games last year. Stetson Bennett, the fourth. The initials at the end of his name also represented where he was on the depth chart. Juggling takeaway, and LSU's got another one.